Hello everybody, and welcome to another edition of Drew's Food Reviews. Today I've got another episode of Classic Candy Corner. And I found these at Big Lots, and I'm gonna kinda do, I'm gonna kinda break these up a little bit, because these really are classics. Now I don't know, this particular one is kinda a new twist on a classic. And I know that everybody out there probably have had this um, from when they were little kids. Usually they come in rolls, or they come like at Christmas time, they come in like a storybook. And they've gone through many different um, changes throughout the years. And I don't think some of these are the original five flavors. And this is the Lifesavers five flavor hard candy. Now this one, Cherry, raspberry, watermelon, orange, and pineapple. Now, I, and individually wrapped, so it's new. I don't think these are the original five flavors because I remember the original five flavors being like cherry, um, I believe pineapple, orange, and then I wanna say lime was the green one and maybe strawberry or something like that. I don't think it was raspberry. I know it was cherry, orange, lime, lemon, but that was it. It was lemon, lime, cherry, and like, I don't know. Anyway, that's not the original ones. This is kind of, I guess, kind of new take on. And four, four pieces is 60 calories, you know, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna go through this and see if I can look at the individual colors. These are all individually wrapped. So you get it in the roll, you know, they're all come in a roll and you have to kind of undo the roll and then they've got different versions of this all throughout the years. Okay, that one's kind of stuck together. Gonna be the watermelon. Gonna be the orange. This one I believe is raspberry. This is gonna probably be cherry. And this is pineapple. Like I said, I think it was lemon, lime. And the other one, this is just another version of the five flavors. Ooh, it's kind of good. I found these at my big lots, they were a dollar for the bag. Mm, watermelon. And they used to come in the rolls they also had individual flavors. It was like all cherry, wild cherry, and then he had tropical, which was like pineapple, banana, coconut. Um, I don't know the other flavors, I think. Yeah, it seemed like banana, coconut, pineapple, tangerine, I think was the other one. They're a little bit, you know, exotic. And then they also had the classics, the peppermint, the winto mint. They had a one for a little while. It was like Cristo mint, which was like a clear. And then they had pepo mint and uh, butter rum. Um, I really think that's it. I don't remember too many more. And then they had the flop five flavors. Um, yeah, it's kind of weird how they've kind of changed the flavors up over the years on the five classic ones. They've also got gummy ones. I've seen um, 
I like the gummy ones and then the sour. Um, lots of different ones, but this truly is the five, five flavors. The original one that started it all off, and I don't know how long they've been around. I'd have to look this up. I know it's got to be a long time. Perhaps I'll look it up and I'll put it in the description, but... Yeah, if you were a classic candy person, you know, usually at Christmas time, they always had the different storybooks. I used to get that from my neighbor all the time. It was like our standard Christmas gift. I'd give him like the Lifesavers storybook and it had like, you know, so a little book and it had a bunch of different roles in there and I get him that and he'd usually get me like um I don't even remember like something else like bubblegum cards or something baseball cards or bubblegum cards or something like that and yeah lifesavers was always a fun thing I also remember for Halloween time they got the little mini rolls of the five flavors and it was like literally five five of them and they would come in a pack hand them out to the trick-or-treaters and I kind of remember that one I would get them all the time because they used to be the, the bad thing was is they would put them by the the checkout counter when you would uh, go out and you know normally kids would always you know pick them up mom can I get this mom can I get that no you have at home and so yeah it was always uh it's always fun for that so <laughs> So you never know. But if you're a fan of the classic, the classic candies and the classic fun of lifesavers, pick up a roll or a bag or I don't know. They've got multiple packs. They also have them for Halloween, individually ones, individually wrapped ones. Um, there's a whole lot of different ones. And uh, I kind of remember it was like something that you would put like in a pinata. You know, like the Brock's candy, the Lifesavers, Sweet Tarts, Pixie Sticks, that kind of thing. And if you are a true classic lover, give these a try. Like I said, I think there's another version of the regular five flavors, but this one's kind of interesting to give this a try, the watermelon was a little different. I've had all the other flavors before. The pineapple, the orange, the cherry. And they're all fun every once in a while. You know, you gotta get some life savers. And, and what's cool is the peppermint or the um, spearmint or the wintergreen. They're nice and refreshing. And if you bit down on the wintergreen ones, they can leave a spark. So you have to do that in the dark, bite down on it, and see if it sparks. So if you are a fan of the Lifesavers, go get a bag or a roll and give them a try and kind of relieve your childhood. So hmm. All right, watermelon's really good. Not real artificial flavor. It's kind of funny that green is a watermelon and not red, but anyways. So, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit the subscribe and the notification bell. That way you won't miss any future content. Or, if I go live, you will not miss the fun. So until next time on Drew's Food Reviews, when I'm be trying something new, or classic for you guys put these aside and um have a couple another day so until next time it's been another episode of classic candy corner hope you enjoyed it and i'll talk to you next time